Carl Sagan, uh, what are some of the dangerous criticism of calling Constitutional Convention you referred to during the interview? I'm a TY2 member, too. I was a, a Majority Report member first. So you have a special place in my heart that Shank will never fill. All right, I love to hear that. Um, well, in this Don Hazen piece, um, it, his argument is that it creates unreasonable expectations uh, and and channels energy into something that can virtually not happen because you need two-thirds of the Senate and then three-quarters of the states. Um, he discounts what I think is um, is valuable about it in terms of raising awareness of of just what the law is now. I mean, we have we have a lot of people who don't even realize who controls the Senate right now. Um, there are others who have concerns about the media things, but I think, you know, uh, an, a properly um, constructed amendment could deal with that. The, and this is all on the day uh, this week that Mark uh, Udall's uh, amendment, I think last week, actually failed. Or I should say, bill to amend the Constitution failed in the Senate. Um, that's the argument. I'm not sure I buy that. Um, but I think from Hazen's perspective, he sees it as sort of clickbait and a way of building email lists. I, I, I'm not as uh, cynical as that. Uh, but I think people can chew gum and, and walk at the same time. <laughs>